if we have to find out is the sin x by 2 and cos x by 2 from given the tan x equals to minus 4 by 3. So in this case, already we know that x is in the second quadrant, so that means pi by 2 is less than x and x is less than pi, dividing with 2. So ultimately we get x by 2 lies in the first quadrant in which all the functions of what are the given over here is positive. Also we know that tan x can be written as tan x by 2 by plus x by 2. So this formula we are going to use in this case. So what we are going to write down here is 2 tan x by 2 by 1 minus tan square x by 2 equals to minus 4 by 3. Cancelling out here with 2 we get here 3 tan x by 2 equals to minus 2 plus 2 tan square x by 2. So this we can write as 2 tan square x by 2 minus 3 tan x by 2 minus 2 equals to 0. Now this is in the quadratic equation so we can write down as 2 tan x by 2 plus 1 into this can be written as tan x by 2 minus 2 equals to 0. So from this what we get is this cannot happen because already we can get it is given that is, you know, x by 2 lies in the side first quadrant. So we take this value that means what we are getting tan x by 2 equals to plus 2. Now, using Pythagoras theorem, we can draw this diagram as this is a 90, 90 degree angle. So, from here we can get sin x by 2 equals to 2 by root 5, or it can be written as 2 root 5 by 5, and cos x by 2 can be written as 1 by root 5, or this can be written as root 5 by 5.